Team Tough Nuts is a powerlifting team. The name Team Tough Nuts uh, is derived from years of going to the gym and seeing those Billy Badasses, the Teddy Tough Nuts, you know, the guys that don't re-rack their weights, you know, maybe they come to the gym, get a quick pump before they go out to the club wearing their fucking Baby Gap t-shirts and their, I don't know, Spiked hair and skinny jeans and shit. what the hell? Skinny jeans. When the hell did that become cool? I I don't understand the skinny jean thing, but whatever. You know, I'm not saying that if you wear tight shirts and skinny jeans, you're a douchebag. But I'm saying that most douchebags wear tight shirts and skinny jeans. Now I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. You know, you, I, I might wear a tight shirt every now and then. Actually, most of my shirts are tight now. But when I first got those shirts, they weren't tight. I just got fat. So now, all my shirts are tight until I decide to buy a fat man wardrobe. I'm going to continue to look like a sausage in a microwave. Just bursting. <clears throat> you know, I got the delusions that I'll just... Uh, I'll just cut the weight back down, you know, that's my motivation to not have to buy new fucking clothes. Well, it's not working, I'm just gonna have to ask Santa Claus for some bigger shirts and bigger jeans. I still got fat guy jeans because my weight bounces up and down all the time, so still got some fat guy jeans. But anyway, so Team Tough Nuts, powerlifting team basically just picking on the douchebaggery that goes on in the gym and I get it you know I might be a douchebag I know I got douchebag tendencies but I re-rack my fucking weights and like I said the only skinny shirts I wear are because I'm a fat guy you know I don't spike my hair I don't have much left as it is I'm starting to rock the fucking monkey butt maybe that's why I hate the people with the hair so I spike the hair I look even thinner so gotta keep that short and mat it down best possible and um, and the logo the logo is not a nut sack as much as you all would like to believe it's a nut sack maybe in zero degree weather or negative five or maybe it's a nut sack after you jumped in a cold pool or did a couple cycles of steroids but it is not a nut sack it is a walnut grenade so mothers, do not be afraid to buy your children some Team Tough Nuts apparel and let them wear it to school. <coughs> Excuse me. They're not going to be forced to flip them inside out like they did when I was growing up with those big Johnson t-shirts and the fucking where's Wadlow where he's pissing off the side of a boat and shit. You know, so. And like I said, even if you are a douchebag, just re-rack your damn weights. Have some gym etiquette. You know, if someone needs to spot, spot them. Walk around with that fucking mad dog face like you got to take a shit or something, you know. When I have that look, it's usually because I do have to take a shit. But like I said, I might be a douchebag too. I didn't, I didn't think I was until I had uh, a few people confirm that I'm an asshole. But I'm your I'm, I'm the people's asshole. So anyway, like I said, Team Tough Nuts, TeamToughNuts.com. The website is still under construction. I'm, I'm learning. You know, trying to get people to show me how to, how to do stuff on there. We got powerlifting meets coming up. We got all kinds of things planned for the future. So I'll keep you updated. Visit the website. Get some gear. Team Tough Nuts. Improve your awesomeness up to 27% by wearing Team Tough Nuts apparel. And uh, that's all I got. Peace.